Okay, 2017 up M8 Street Glide motor mounts. So there's a bolt in that it that runs through here. Through your mount, through the other side. Take the nut off, slide that out. Take your floorboard loose, two bolts. And then take your brake loose, three bolts. And then this comes down out of the way. And this mount will be in here like that. And it'll sit in this cup. So there goes that mount. And then, it's not like the twin cams where you just unbolt two bolts and bam, you're done. This side, you physically you can't get out because there's not enough room. I got my top mount loose. But you still can't move the motor over enough to get that out. So you come to the rear, where typically this bushing right here would be inside the swing arm there. Then this collar would fit inside of the bushing. And then this bolt right here holds it all in. But in order to get the other side loose, you have to put this back on to where you can hold this to get the nut or the bolt loose so then we come around to the other side so then you come to the other side and I just put a socket on there with the original bolt and just tap this with my mallet until it goes over enough where you can get this inner bushing out once you get this bushing out you can go back to the front and tilt the motor to the right to where you could get that bushing out all right so I pulled the whole pin bolt out of the swing arm hopefully that don't come back to bite me Okay, with the swing arm bolt loose, got the swing arm lifted up enough to where I can weasel the old mount out and put this new one in. Little notch there, and it fits in. It's supposed to anyway. It ain't much of a notch, but it's there. Now that you got your new mount in on that side, but you still got your swing arm bolt out, you can move your motor over enough to get this front one out. And then just reverse process. <laughs> 